The Pocophone F1 was released back in the second half of 2018 and it was an excellent flagship smartphone with great value for money. But that was back in 2018. Is it still relevant in 2019? Well, in our opinion, it's still a very good smartphone to get right now and here are a couple of reasons why the Pocophone F1 is still very relevant in 2019. First of all, the Pocophone F1 is a powerful smartphone. Powering this phone is a Qualcomm Snapdragon 845 chipset and it's a fast flagship tier SoC. In fact, until the Snapdragon 855 is available in a consumer ready smartphone, the 845 is still the best chipset you can get right now from Qualcomm. Besides that, the Pocophone F1 has excellent battery life too. Thanks to the combination of a 1080p screen and a 4000mAh battery, we can get over 8 hours of screen time in our review. That's really really impressive and not many phones can match this. Surprisingly enough, despite its affordable price tag, the Pocophone F1 has really good camera performance. Its 12 megapixel plus 5 megapixel camera can capture good looking shots regardless of lighting condition. I would say its low light performance could still use some work, but at this price point, it's, it's a really good camera performance. And you can just install the Gcam app, which is a camera app ported from the Google Pixel smartphones to get even better camera performance. But in my opinion, the best reason to get the Pocophone F1 right now is its exceptional value for money. Right now, you can easily get the 128GB model with 6GB of RAM for about 1399 ringgit. Compare that to the launch price of 1599 that's 200GB saving right there. The 64GB model with 6GB of RAM, on the other hand, can be bought for about 1199 ringgit now, which is around 100 ringgit cheaper than the launch price. Considering the feature set of this phone, you really can't get better performance or anything else at this price point. So those are some reasons why the Pocophone F1 is still very relevant in 2019. It's an excellent affordable flagship smartphone and if you want to read our review of it, you can do so in the description down below. Like this video if you like it, subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and of course, as always, stay tuned for good stuff to come at Next Rift.